just in time. Yeah, perfect timing. So if your run was bad, you would have missed the start of the stream. So you had to clutch out the world record to catch my stream in time. That's that's what did it. Um, so do you know what time it's going to be? Like, like two hours, ten go. seconds, about twenty minutes, ten seconds. Like or like... Let's not see itself look exactly. I'm really curious. You must have done something earlier in the level that just ruined everything, and I'm I'm really curious what it is. Because yeah, I could not get the stop to happen um, from a later save. See you on the other side. Two thirty-six. I'm seeing heavy enemy fire on drop pad. Oh, minus two thirty-six. I see. That was confusing the other for some reason. Are we just split again. Hold on. Mitchell. All right, so it's like definitely not a two nineteen, but it's probably water mode. Come on, Mitchell. Now. What's what record is it? 2028? So, so that's cutting it really close. <laughs> Resetting drop point. You recorded it all? Game volume a little high. Yeah, it is for some reason. I don't know why. Break this down! Do I just like I swear the game volume went up and I like I was just thinking I have my headset turned all the way down and it's like kinda loud. What the heck? I don't know. You still in one piece? I'll just take that time once I guess. Mitchell! Get the door! Watch this run be a 22401. I'll be so triggered. I lost about five seconds changing the video. AW cringe. So I say, did you ever have issues with this first level, by the way? With like soft locking or just game being bad in general in any number of ways? Because this was always the biggest issue for me. But you guys doing Global Fuse seem to never have a problem with it. And it always confused me. But yeah, Andy, that goes for you too. Did you never have an issue with this first level? Because yeah, this was this level was just like the bane of my existence in Advanced Warfare the entire time. Like the skips are easy, they're fine. This level is so goddamn broken. And we finally found something that potentially fixes everything. Then Dylan was running into issues today with that as well, of course. I'm really, I'm really curious how you guys never had issues. Like, the issue is caused by going too fast, but the too fast is what anyone would reach easily. Oh, the fuel's trash, really? I actually need this, but like, I don't know, I'm being safe or something.
Oh my god, I'm getting bullied. Stop that. I guess slightly. That might still gold, but it was not very good. And every other run, you wait around until the 330 for turret. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Isn't the MDL of max boom speed as well? But either way, it's useless. There's actually no point to grabbing it. Yeah, that makes sense. And so I guess I'm always just going to land on the ground there for safety, even though it didn't seem necessary. He teleported so quickly. Interesting. He was there really early. Guilt is slower than ARs in multiplayer. I am like 95% sure it's fast in this game. Um, I'll have to show you at some point, I guess, with the bullets and meter. Or you can just check like, myself, I guess. I'm, I'm fairly sure it's full speed. V very few guns in single player are slow in most of these games. Like, it's pretty much just a slow rapper that are slow. And yeah, obviously it's still working. So yeah, I don't know, I don't know um, what you might have done differently that was breaking this. It's actually really interesting. Thanks for the sub. Looking video. Yeah, I'll definitely have a look at that after I'm done streaming. See if I can spot any differences. Because that is really weird. Like, it's definitely something we want to be aware of to, like, tell people to avoid. Stay with me. You're going to be alright. One day I'll get a sub 8 on this when I don't screw up everything and don't change my audio settings mid run. <laughs> I'm assuming the game volume is like fine now, right? Like I just kind of yolo the uh, After a second the volume setting. That was an improvement, but it's not hard to improve on garbage. Try it again. He's behind family, friends. So we're just slowly improving. Hopefully, I get a Utopia and Biolab gold this run. I really just want to get a low fourteen Biolab, just just for the golds. Not even to like get a good run today. I don't know why, but the golds are like more important to me sometimes. Sorry, Mitchell. Will was one of our best. Look, we take care of our own. If you ever need an excuse me, Private Mitchell. I see it's Jonathan six now, I'm not nine. I'm Will's father. I actually don't know why I used nine before. I must have had my sure lines on my mouse in a different way. Private Mitchell. But now nine Will's is like the most awkward mouse mind, and six is a good one. It was an unfortunate tragedy, sir. It was more than unfortunate, Sergeant. It was unnecessary. Son. Uh, with the chat input. <laughs> Miss Irons, Mitchell's been discharged with his injuries. I'm aware of his injuries, Sergeant. At Atlas. Nine has always been like the tough button on my mouse, like the DPI toggle. Um, told me what kind of which is, I, I don't, I, maybe I was using that to like S rafe with, in, to float with, I mean, on induction, because that's why I have it on two buttons. So I can float and actually S rafe both ways. But that's so awkward to hold that button while S rafing out of there. I must have just done that, I guess. 
So yeah, like the BAL is a slow weapon. It's one of the only slow weapons in the, in the campaign, I think. Yeah, that guy didn't die something else. Oh, yeah. I think the reason I was having troubles with that umbrella jump before is because I was trying to jump it with the BAL, the slow weapon, instead of the pistol. Which is kind of dumb. They do it. Damn, that's pretty slow. Unfortunate. Close on the kitchen. Close. Close on the kitchen. Third try, not bad. You, Alice. Yeah, no thanks. to a boost. Damn. Finally the sub-10 night drop. I feel like he's been running the uh, call who's been running that for like, I don't know, for like a month or more at this point. 641 okay. attempts. Holy shit. <laughs> Try and move your arm. Making a small adjustment. Hang on. The scientist tornado. Okay. The first Again, call. please. I think I see the problem. It's honestly One hilarious. Time, like 641 attempts of a of a 10 minute IL. I don't think I've even done right, 641 good. attempts of any kill run levels yet. Although it's probably bridge. quite close in a few of them. Got the got, to get, got to get that satisfying number though. Sub 10 is definitely very cool. I I legitimately don't know if I'm ever going to get the sub 20 on that one World War 2 tank level. Because it's it's the only COD level above 20 minutes. So it'll be super satisfying to get. But World War 2 is a trash game. And that level needs to be nearly perfect for a sub 20. Like it's actually so painful. And the tank section is basically random. It's awful. That someone's gonna do it. The Rexo is equipped with overdrive. Use it if you need a tactical advantage. The overdrive battery burns out quick, so use it sparingly. Step up to the station when you're ready. It's a really time I forgot you need to start it. Begin round one. Overdrive. Don't even have to shoot them. Two. Yeah, but I have to flex by getting 3,000 points every time. Plus, like, just standing here doing nothing would be so much more boring. Use overdrive. I assume using overdrive would take more time, right? Round 
Round three. What the heck that's weird? Easy game. Training complete. Your score was perfect. Shit, where'd this guy come from? Boss, we got the same ready. I don't think so. I think Overdrive is just straight time scale. In fact, I've had a few bugs when using it lately where, um, like sometimes when you time scale a game, they'll get weird about, um, the maximum frame rate. So, like, AW is capped to 150 right now. Um, but when using Overdrive, it would sometimes just, like, go to 16 FPS, which was kind of dumb. Activating grenade Training complete. Your score was perfect. Exo Mark III demonstration beginning in five minutes in the atrium. The AW is back. Honestly, the so I usually like to have the speed meter so that it's like the cutoff at the lowest point is just above regular sprinting speed, which is also true on AW. So like you can see, it just barely goes up. But the, the max peak has to be so high in this game because of the exo boost it's going to like a thousand. But like regular strafes look like nothing. It's kind of funny. The weird save percent is above this building. Yeah, I thought so. So I could see into like the training areas and stuff. So did you ever figure out what causes the president to spawn? Like do you have to? Is there a trigger in this elevator? Is there a trigger up here? Like, if you can just no clip up here and walk around and then go to the president? Execute. Like, I'm kind of curious what prerequisites that has. Elevator. Go oh, that's that's really unfortunate. <laughs> Damn. Gotta hate when they do things like correctly. I swear to God, I jumped. I actually hate this game. So while I said so many times that this skip is easy and free and everyone should be doing it, I have had way too many issues with it, honestly. <laughs> you just need to jump before you move. That's my problem. Because if you move into the side of the wall, you kind of just float there and you can't jump because you're not technically on the ground and the beam sucks. Yeah, exactly. Like, that's how most COD games are coded. Like everything's in a string of like necessary stuff like that so that you can't really skip anything. PW usually is built that way. That turret's destroying me, holy shit. Oh. That was a pointless time list man about was there, that was pretty stupid. Literally no reason I should miss that. Sir, he's ready for some real work. Good job, son. Welcome to Atlas. After Korea, I thought I was done. 
put irons. New traffic routes on you? No. <laughs> um, I'm going to keep doing the crash risk route until I actually crash, because I'm fairly sure I have have it solved. But I would definitely recommend anyone else learning it new to just do the crash avoidance thing, because as far as I'm aware, that that out of bounds is pretty simple, right? No difficult jumps or, or whatever you really needed. We got multiple KBA, south room on the second floor. Keep moving. Conference room up ahead. There's the Prime Minister. Boss, look who's with him. Hades. We gotta bag him. PM's our first priority. We are all men, born to die, some guilty, some innocent. The only question is, when and how? We live by God's grace. Let's kill him with a cheap zeppy. You are mistaken. Achieve a great deal. Prophet, they just executed. I like how the first objective is rescue the Prime Minister, and the first thing I do is just leave. <laughs> leave the Prime Minister in there. Three mics to phase line out. Clock's on. If we attack now, they will kill the Prime Minister. They'll kill him anyway. We'll get him out alive. Keep it tight. Let's oh, show them what this can do. KDA have been terrorizing Easy this region hit. for far too long. It's time to send them a message. A handshake with the Prime Minister, I can turn this entire region around. Oh so my god, I must be too far. No pressure. Prussia? Well, Prussia. I Good really luck. hate landing up there. It makes me so paranoid of, like, just completely falling off. Oh my god. I always do that boost too early. So you get where that thing is. God, can they actually die though? Holy shit. Maybe before I crash now, because they just all stumbled instead of actually dying. It's kind of stupid. Cars look like they from a PS2 game. Okay, my graphics aren't turned up that high. This game actually looks really good when it's maxed out. But yeah. Get across the street! Watch yourself! That was really fast. Copy that, Prophet. I did that actually did that section so well. Mitchell, on me. You should have eyes on the truck. I see it. But I did everything Damn. first right here. This is actually really good. Let's do this. Jump. I only just realized, like Yeah, it might be. <laughs> I guess there's a small chance he crashes because I shot less of the earlier people, but I shot two people after shooting the turret guy, so I think, from my understanding, this there's like no way this should crash. Yeah, it should crash. I honestly think it's pretty easy to avoid. Just killing zero people causes the crash, basically. Why is this boss going so fast? <laughs> I don't really know why my graphics are so low, like, I just don't care about graphics when running a game, I don't like, but the game's capped at 150fps, so it's, it's like, not a performance reason. 
I just don't have the graphics very high. So you can take out this helicopter much faster, um, but I think I actually have to avoid shooting these people on the helicopter. I think I actually have to hit the helicopter itself more. Enemy cover. Take it down. Oh, oh, there it is. Yeah, nice. And then we just wait for this bus to change. Oi, no dozing. Job's not over till I say it is. Please tell me this fucker's alive. Stop stressing, he's breathing. Barely. What the hell do we want with this guy anyway? Don't know, don't care. That's up to the boffins back at HQ. You get your money's worth a journey? You delivered exactly as promised. Drinks on me tonight. Yeah. You did all right, Mitchell. That was pretty speedy. New traffic water record. Easy. That was an improvement, but it's not hard to improve on garbage. Was Try it again. Sub 720, that's pretty good. I think it is, right? I, I think the water record was 725. If I remember right. I'm actually just going to go check real quick. Yeah, it was 7.25, so you would have for about like 6 seconds. Actionable intel that the KVA are trying to trigger a meltdown in the reactor building. We're inserting in the south courtyard and we'll push north. This shit ends in the control room. Get in position. Yeah, I probably will play some W2. I don't know how serious I'll take the speedrun, it depends on if the game's fun or not, basically. But I'll, I'll probably do some Yeah, I should just not fail the mission today. What I, I failed the boost out of the, like, to the very end last time. It was really stupid. I just forgot what buttons to press. This is not my favorite code. It's a good one, um, but there's there's way too many cutscenes and stuff. It makes it kind of boring. The skips are really cool. Everyone's favorite card. 
Legit, the hardest part about this gift is just being on the correct spot in the reeling. Like that, and then it's free. I just got hit by that. I don't know if that can kill you or something, that was kind of sketchy. Movements here. I didn't aim at the right spot. What is my problem? I, I haven't practiced this very much. I just kind of said I'm going to do this different ending because it's easy, and it is easy. But when you don't practice something, that doesn't like that doesn't really help. Yeah, the. Aiming for the road is a thousand times easier. I just need to actually know what I'm doing rather than being stupid. Like, look how much I made that by. It's not even close. I also don't know if I can go around to the right side of that building. That's worth some investigation. But I don't want to risk, like, failing right now. I have a feeling there's just no floor or something there. Yeah, well, that was pretty stupid again. It's so easy. I literally, I can just take my time and look where I'm going to go and then press the key like half a second later. When you're going to the other building, you've got to like have everything pre-figured out and uh, and just like flick over there and boost down and make it. Going down to the road, I just need to chill out, take my time and play properly. Who's Cardo? Yeah, I don't know either. God, that loses so much time. I'm so sad. I did the same thing last time. That's like, it's legit nearly a minute of time loss. It's so dumb. I guess I should just round it down to 40 seconds to be safe. Cringe. I assumed Carter was someone you like meet up with or do something with in the actual level. But I could be wrong. Maybe it's the pilot. <laughs> uh, I don't really like Code Euro. It's just a much worse Code One. That doesn't even give it much credit. It's literally just a worse game made on Code One's engine. Now, the KVA have the balls to move in next door. Fuck me. I think Aftermath should be free. Uh, we'll see. I've practiced it a little bit, so it should be easy. You look like shit. But you never know. Twenty-two days straight. KVA Don't think even super like you are, yeah. <laughs> Copy that. Hey, we're gonna start you always United Offensive. It's the second fuck game I've ever made. Up. Um, so they had COD 1, which was Infinity target. Ward, and good game, time. everything. Dr. Pierre Danois, he's in and the then United off. Offensive released the next We're year, green. it was a completely different dev studio, working on the same COD 1 engine, and the levels are just like terribly made in my opinion. So the game still feels kind of nice to play, except for the fact that they added the most jank sprinting of all time, and it's so dumb. <laughs> but like, the guns and everything feel the same as COD 1 as far as I remember, I think. But yeah, it's just the way the levels are structured is not very fun. For my rating today, um, that is impossible to answer. <laughs> I literally just like look randomly. If you, one of you guys wants to stream before I finish, then yeah, sure. Ozzy, go, go stream learning AW with Broken Finger or whatever it was you said. <laughs> That dang. So you've only done the one run, right? Did you practice some stuff Check or like so as far as I remember you did a run, like you didn't get what record, but it wasn't too far off of being a blind run. Scanning for isotopes. Please wait. What the hell are the 
AVA doing in Detroit, boss? Oh, you haven't been able to then. Well, good luck. <laughs> good place to hide something. Or someone. Clear. Look out there. Gideon, Torres, you set? The second run does always get better than the first. Usually. I'm honestly, I'm quite upset about missing fish in there. This would have been a really good act one. But it, like, induction still wasn't that good. I'm not gonna lie. And Atlas was like, fine. I missed the thing on Atlas as well. But it was just traffic that was amazing. Everything else was like, good enough. Remember, capture only. We need him to find Hades. You lost 15 minutes on numbers, what the heck? Like, you lost 15 minutes, or is that just 15 slower than recruit? Hold on. We got four operatives on bikes heading in. Mission order 557. Damn, okay. <laughs> I was also considering looking at numbers and like, trying that IL for better. Because I, I knew that IL from uh, playing it a couple times. But it's... I don't know... It really bothers me, like, why do they make you take 4 damage by dropping like 3 feet? Profit, it's not even one. that. Delta. <laughs> it's like kinda Stay stupid. Damn. Can't believe this is Detroit. It hasn't changed that much. Okay, no fails, let's go. Look how late that save was. Beautiful. Really? I missed that. Oh, seriously? That's unfortunate. I'm, I'm a little faulty. This jump was supposed to be easy. Really? Am I like jumping from too far back or something? <laughs> like, damn. I must be jumping from too far back. I don't know what's going on. I genuinely don't know how I'm missing this. It was so easy in practice. There we go. What the heck? Turn off the slow mode, god damn. I have it on 5, which is honestly not a very good bind for it. Yeah, longer run ups probably the key. I think I was jumping from too far back, slash maybe not at full Profit. speed yet. We're at checkpoint blue. Unfortunate, because that jump was just always first or second try in practice. Those have sucked too. One day I'll get my sub-13 gold on this level. I could not turn, I had too much speed. Unfortunate. No Act 1. Well, maybe it's Act 1 record, but I won't be happy with it. I doubt it's record, to be honest. I lost way too much. I don't know how much that lost. Was that like 40 seconds? Probably wasn't that much. It was the fourth try or something, so it's not very good. It probably was about that much. And fishing was like 40 seconds as well. Side jump on the rails. I'm not sure what you mean. Now. Forces are inbound. We got you covered. Now you take the doctor, 
Move out while you can. I'd like to know who's watching my back, mate. That's classified, mate. If you're talking about the, the jump I just did, then I'm yeah, sure I guess. It's one of the train tracks. It's probably the hardest single jump in the run. Like, it'd be harder than the Atlas jump, I guess. Oh my god, I got the way. Damn, my mouse is on low battery. <laughs> yeah, I forgot to charge it, so it's at 15% right now. I'm pretty sure it will be fine for the rest of the run, but I guess we'll see. Wouldn't that be a way to kill the run? Mouse just dies. It's so uncomfortable to play with the quad plugged in on this mouse too, so I'm not even going to bother. Yeah, I honestly... um. I'm only using this mouse because it's new, I guess. But I, I honestly preferred my old wired G502 for a couple of reasons. Not just because wireless bad or anything, um, but like I don't prefer the new sensor, the old one. It's still good, but like there's just a couple like specific issues that I've got. Did this seriously lose like a minute? That's terrible. Damn. Aftermath cringe. Upstairs. Very loud steps. This is probably the hardest quad run to learn if you're going to do the skips. It's not very hard in terms of like avoiding death or anything. Some of the quad games are way more difficult than that. Um, but yeah, I don't know. This, the skips are like. It's, a, it's like a different skill set, but they're really difficult. I honestly don't even notice the wire on my map, on my mice. It's probably because I play with high sensitivity, but like, I don't know. <laughs> it's just not an issue to me. It, it, the only issue is like, the wire for the wireless mice is like terrible, I don't know. So that one like gets in the way of something. Sprint or do anything, that was weird. I like how that brick just appears there. Okay, I'm going to attempt the head bounce, but I have literally no idea what I'm doing, so there's a 0% chance it's going to work. Do you just sideways boost off the bottom step, or like, do you have to do anything else fancy? Okay, I d it didn't even boost. <laughs> Did that guy just phase the fence? I almost didn't make that again. Like, do you jump and then sideways boost, or do you just run down and boost? That dog is chasing you. Imagine I get, like, tackled by a dog right now. <laughs> okay, yeah, we're good. Yeah, I should definitely go practice that at some point, but I'm just too lazy to get through so much of the level to make a save for it, honestly.
Didn't know this game had dogs. Yeah, not many. This game feels like an Infinity Ward game, honestly. In a lot of the ways. The way the guns feel. Um, they have dogs. That's just like such an Infinity Ward thing for some reason. Just like with all the added cutscenes and stuff. At least didn't get in, didn't get slowed down this time, fall behind me and just like go everything. Uh, this was actually not as slow as I thought, am I crazy? Like, I know this ending takes a while, but like, what? I thought it would be way worse than this. Save him now. Much thanks. The target is secure. We're taking him in for interrogation. Get here now. Yeah, somehow. That that really I'm okay, never mind. That did lose like forty seconds. That is math. It was as close as <laughs> It's just that it was so slow before, I guess. That's actually act one water record, I'm pretty sure, but it's trash, so I'm not even gonna record it. Gotta highlight it or whatever. I need to get a forty five. Keep your eyes on Hades, mark me. Key man is approaching. Mark him. You're up, Mitchell. Okay, I'm gonna try the thing of switching the camera late and see if that lets me scan him quickly. Let's find a key man. Scan for comm signals. You'll have to zoom in for a proper scan. Now, look for the KVA comm I suck. Okay. That'll be our ticket inside the safe house. He's not here. Switch to another camera. There. Check him out. Yeah, that did Call work. Is a KBA match. Interesting. KBA I was trash anyway. I did like four other things wrong, but whatever. That's our ticket inside. We're I'm not doing the new manhunt out of bounds. I should do like a full run of it at some point just to see what time I get. But I think it's going to struggle to do so late. So that's just like not fun, something in my opinion. Even if it was more consistent. And it's like. I think it would take a decent amount of practice to be comfortable with, because it's a pretty big punishment if you fail near the end. Although it shouldn't be, like failing shouldn't be super likely if you know what you're doing, but... <laughs> Have fun with that. This is private property! You need to leave! I'm looking for the market. I guess I got lost. <laughs> nice work. Weapons ready. Alpha, Alpha be advised. Control. Bravo is on the X. Roger that. Damn it. Terrible. Easy. Bravo, KBA inbound. Civilians in play. Out of the way! Get inside and stay there! Careful of civilians! KBA, incoming! Alpha, we're hitting a ton of interference. What's your status? We're crawling with KBA. Keep pushing forward and try to cut off Hades. Roger that. Easy game. Take them out. Switch to 60 FPS because placebo that maybe it lets me through the window easier. Take them out. Okay, that really paid off. Damn. Yeah. <laughs>
So, by the way, 60 FPS is not the instant cure to that window at all. I've tried it a bunch of times and it's really bad sometimes. I just got really lucky there. But I'm like 20% sure that it does help a little bit. Who knows? <laughs> the cure is not to do the window. Kind of true. I practiced this ending clear a little bit yesterday as well, so we'll see if this is any good. Bravo, Hades inbound. Can you not? Can you literally do anything else? I will kill you. Holy shit. <laughs> if I go too far right there, I revert all the way to before the window. I have never seen him take that route. He never just fully blocks like that. Cringe game. And I'm pretty certain I'd die if I kill any civilian there as well, so like, dumb. Bravo, do not let up. Get Hades at any cost. Yeah, that was decent. I'm so triggered. That was actually a really clean manhunt. Apart from that guy bullying me. What was that? Third try first window? Second try second window? Everything else was good. Thanks for the luck. Just in time for the funniest fight scene. Which is the bad guy Hades fighting his own demons. Um, was I was I not pressing F? Am I trash? Okay, I think I was pressing G actually. I'm so good at this game. Thanks for that. All right, let's get you out of here. ID is confirmed. Hades is EKIA. I send again. Hades is EKIA. <coughs> he knows. Irons knows. There's no way this gold's right. I, no, I think this takes way too long. What does Irons know? It was actually kind of close. If I didn't get bullied by that guy, it would have been gold, I think. <laughs> oh my god. Well, time for the Utopia time save. 12 seconds or whatever it is. Ready for some get over it after the run? I guess so. How does it feel to be the hero of the world? Don't let it go to you. Gideon, Mitchell, I need to see you right now. Bellona, what is it? Meet me in maintenance room. Still farming. <laughs> Don't bring anyone else. All right, we're moving. Find out what the hell she wants. I honestly should just plug my mouse in for the two minutes of, of like cutscene here. Like, it's not like I need to aim here. Yeah? Hard to believe this is Baghdad. Well, I waited too long. I should have done a change load. Refuse to spend them. You're just gonna wait for something for a good opportunity. So the best opportunity that everyone missed was when I first started doing runs. I had, I think it was for 25k points, was reset any run, and I'm absolutely not doing that anymore. There's no way. <laughs> Because like, I think back then it was when I, when I first got the 122 MW2 and I'm like, I, I don't really care, like, I'm not going to improve by much, I'm just kind of streaming for fun, for practice. No one had enough points to redeem it, and by the time they did, I was already at the point of improving again, and I'm like, nope, 
don't, <laughs> don't want that to be a thing. This is it. He always stops there, I don't think I lost time. Now I get to charge my mouse for like two minutes. So the scrambler will only buy us a few minutes. Sink to my card, I have to show you something. Bloody hell's going Just on. Gotta do the rename it. splits option. That's irons. That's probably a Technology decent way to use up safe. points, but so many people have so many points that like he never made it back <laughs> What to do like ten K for it or something? You told me everything. Plus, like, I don't know, I like having splits as a level name so I know what's coming up next. They wanted me to come I would I would start getting confused if they were changed. Where are they planning on heading? Seattle, Paris. Thousands will die. We have to tell someone. We have to tell everyone. It's okay, it's all right. I'm gonna take care of this right now. Fuck me. He knew it. He knew and he let it happen. All those people dead and he fucking profited from it. Where did you get this? Hades. His last act before he died was giving us this. How do you know it's not? It was coded and encrypted in our own algorithm. It's from Atlas. No one has seen it but us. We need to get out of here. No! Look straight at the flashbang. Eating with a fork is impossible. We saw it. So what did, what did you do to we your hand? Everything. You saw what? You knew about the attacks. You can spill speedrun? Of course, because speedrunning is more important than eating. You're insane! You're a monster! I'm disappointed in you. You could have had everything. Hold them here until the reporters leave. Gideon. Yes, sir. Gideon! Oh, nice. You know what you saw. He said it was a fake. He's made his decision. Stay where you are. Listen, we've got the Leo exosystem. I need you to trust me. In three seconds, the fire suppression system will be activated. Get ready to run. Go. Now. I actually feel like I lost like five seconds. By plugging my mouse in there, I could be wrong. We need to get out of here. Why is Kevin Spacey no. in this game? Uh, because COD had all the money right now at this point in time. Wait, did I just face through that door? What? Since when? That guy died from a hand push, yes. <laughs> Made no sense. Hold on. Start is this the only time we use mag grips in the entire run now? Hello, go right on the time. That's totally what I wanted to do. Oh my god, move please. <laughs> That's not a good spot to boost. Oh my god, that boost is pointless. Oh my god, there's so much shit in the way in this level, I actually hate it. Don't melee me, he meleeed me. God damn it. Oh 
waiting for you at the end of the box. I actually spawned really quickly. Can I move, please? I don't know what I got stuck on there. The spirit is impeccable, yes. But that whole section is just so cringe. There's so much stuff in the way of everything. And like, every every doorway, like, I don't know, it just, it just grabs you better than anything else in any good game. It's so weird. But that was definitely a, a worse than usual story. Look how much speed I'm getting up here, a thousand. Oh my god. European time zones. Are you alright? Can you move? Copy. So yeah, uh new skip is coming up here by the way. It saves like twelve seconds and it's pretty easy. Twelve seconds isn't that much. It's not that important, but like I don't know, I like it. It skips the um the next like mag grips climbing sequence. That's a that's a good um strategy anti on so Okay, so right here. Watch me fail it because I've never failed it yet. Hello? Hello? I don't even need to mantle, it's just like. There we go. That barely even saved time because I was so bad at doing it. And easy. Uh, yeah, I made a video comparing both routes. I did the grapple, like, and my new one as well. My new thing saves like three seconds, and it's so difficult. It's so difficult. Um, but yeah, doing both of them, it saves like sixteen seconds or something. Fifteen seconds, it's pretty good. Remember your old sergeant, don't you? Let's get you out of here. Go, Mitchell. Order. Go, Mitchell. I'll hunt you down. Just keep telling me to go. I'm not wrong. I'm a fool. What you said? Roof is clear. Go, Mitchell. All right. Inside. Now. This utopia was kind of cringe, but I think it's still gold anyway because of that skip. Go, Mitchell. Yeah, two, ten, nineteen. Nice. That was an improvement, but it's not hard to questions. improve on garbage. It's Try times. it again. Here he comes. Time to find out what we signed up for. Good to have you back in the fold. Wish we were under better circumstances. We'll be up against our old teammates. People we trained with. Fought with. I like how much I camera control they give me. But I need you to move past. Scene is so immersive now. This is bigger than any of us. Team, so what is Sentinel, and where do they get all this technology and money from? You know 
Because it's literally just like some guy that was in the military seven years ago. I'll be leading the insertion team. The SEAL teams will be on standby for extra. Iron is priority number one. We infiltrate his home and we gather the US military? Move. So it's literally. Okay, he's just still part of the US military, I guess. That makes sense. I pay so little attention to the story. Like, I don't even. I ask these questions and I could answer them by watching. Paying attention to the game, but I just don't want to. Plus, I literally couldn't if I tried. I'm in. The drone patrols are switching out. Clock is ticking. Yeah, probably something like that. Kind of makes sense. You would expect the U.S. to be Atlas's like biggest um, hurdle in taking over the world, right? But they're totally just like focusing on attacking Korea or whatever. Did I do that way too late? Where do I- I go here, okay. I figured it out, finally, holy shit. I did do that way too late. Not way too late, I was like a second off or something. Iron's personal estate. So this is what thousands of dead bodies will buy you. I'll track down Irons. We need to be there when he meets with his contact. Alone on me. So did they ever like, move. talk about, um, or explain how the exosuit works. Like, what what is boosting you? Do they just have like jet engines on the on the exosuit? Super Mario speedrun? No thanks. Oh, that makes sense. Dark, yeah. Who watched the cutscenes there? By the way, take notes of this level, anyone who uh, who needs sentinel improvement, because this is completely free and easy. It cannot fail, and it is the fastest route. So basically I'm talking to you, Azzy, because I think Andy was already watching yesterday. <laughs> but specifically the route out of here, because um, I always had issues getting caught in this level. Like, it was kind of inconsistent, but after playing Veteran, I found a really good strat. This, this route's just like a couple seconds faster than what we were doing back then. Oh my god, I didn't jump. That was cringe. I almost fell. You gotta go way right here. In between these cars. Boost up here. Easy. Never get caught. Free video game. That boost sucked. Correct. his desk. Get started. We're in. Let's see what we can find. Found something. Knox, we've got the meeting itinerary. It's in the hangar. It's happening soon. The hangar sealed up tight. Locked out of the system. I see it. They sent out a full alert. Patrols are headed your way. You gotta get out of there. There's a convoy incoming. Northwest entrance, TA 30 seconds. Make your move it. Can't miss that. That convoy's our ticket to the hangar. I should build this to be honest. I think I was still slow at the beginning because for some reason I'm just terrible at the grapples at the start. 
but my 858 gold here is not good. I got an 852 or 851 on veteran. I'm also a little sad, because um, I think the new induction route would have been quite helpful for Veteran. I don't know about consistency wise, but I think it would have saved a lot of time. Because I had to go quite slow for a lot of reasons. So did I. Biolab has a faster Veteran record than Recruit right now too, which is kind of funny. Hopefully I should fix that, like, soon, but, uh, yeah, it's, it's weird. Would the car be noticeably slower? I mean, it's basically like having two extra passengers, right? I don't know how much the exosuits weigh, um, because they're, they're, they're pretty small, right? Like, thin strips of metal and stuff. Just like, strong robotics. That is the longest range grapple in the entire game. I don't know why. <laughs> they just let you grab it from so far away. Is that like 15 kilos or something? They're not freaking units. I, don't, I legitimately wonder if America is ever going to change away from using inferior units. Is this even going to gold? Why do I suck at this level so much? Okay, it did gold that barely. Did <laughs> that time save level? What the heck? Try it again. Okay, wait a minute. If I can... If I can play well for these next few levels, this is like the best act to of all time. Because that manhunt was really good as well. But that is, that is asking a lot on these two levels. So I also, I went and tried Biolab a few more times, and I never instantly died like happened last run, twice. And I have no idea why, I have no idea what causes that, I just, I could not figure it out. So if I die again on Biolab a couple times, I'm going to be extremely upset, because I just, I don't know what to do to fix it. Hydrogen peroxide, really.
Sergeant is securing the cargo. All units be advised. We picked up an Atlas QRF on approach. Drop pods are inbound on your position. Visual two. Load the cargo onto Guardian They're bomb functional. ASAP. I'll give them that. That was really quick. Nice. When did drop pods first become like an idea? Like the science fiction thing? Because they, they make so little sense. Like how are you going to keep people alive in drop pods? Or do you just keep, you just keep soldiers in orbit at all times? To just like send them down like it kind of makes sense as the fastest way to get people somewhere if you do want to store them in orbit and if you want to kill them on impact but that's about it <laughs> haven't made manhunt jump like 50 attempts uh which manhunt jump the, the trash window but yeah it takes me over a minute sometimes it's really dumb Aftermath. Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah, I don't... So, the most important thing by far is the um, the first jump, the first boost. Boosting as soon as you can after jumping. But, like, it's so close anyway. <laughs> There's so many other ways you can ruin it by doing things slightly incorrectly. But that's what helps me the most, is focusing on that. Looks to be an opening through here. Oh, that boost went nowhere. The cargo is up ahead. Keep moving. Damn, I can't move. team should be actively freezing to death. Why is that? Like, we're in Antarctica and it is negative Celsius, but, um, like, they knew this is where the mission was going. They should have, like, prepared for it with what they're wearing. I think it actually says the temperature on the exosuit somewhere. If we can get a good look at it. Or it did before, anyway. I said like minus 12.8c. Okay, so they would be dead from the fall. I don't think they'd be freezing to death though, but I don't know. I've never fallen down an, a crevasse in a glacier or whatever. Okay, nice. That was. Um, I have the wrong gun out, but like whatever, I guess. Two pairs of long jaws. <laughs> yep. Oh my god. You're like not. What I bully? SMH. Contact ahead! Drones incoming! Use your AMPs! The cargo is so satisfying pulling straight down, I think. Damn it, they've got the cargo. Open fire! Move! We need that cargo! Missiles fire! 
Um, so I don't know if this crash is gold as well. It might be. This was like pretty good. I forgot to sprint. Good job, me. Zero one. Whereas a Michael's a KIA. What? Why now, Gideon? You could have escaped from New Baghdad with us. And we'd all be none the wiser. There's just too many questions. I need to find some answers for myself. So funny having a smart generation when you read this slow. Like, what is this? MW 2019? <laughs> Hello? Is it only take the line? I'm ready for pickup. Sentinel operatives have been dealt with. Roger that, Gideon. You're lucky we were just about to leave without you. Keep pushing to the cargo! cargo secure. Yes, sir. Secure and intact. Yeah, I felt like it took longer than normal for the helicopter to spawn. But I don't know if I'm imagining things. We've got multiple heat signatures. Are you sure you're on There should still be a fast time. I might be imagining things. I feel like that wasn't working for ages either. Am I just dumb? I think I am. I think this is fine. <laughs> it just feels like everything's taking so long. Do you mean you can run to the crate earlier? Oh. Three seconds. Okay, never mind. <laughs> is this a sub 10? It might be. That would be so satisfying. It's definitely sub 10. That's so nice. This fade out takes a while though. Keep pushing the cargo. <laughs> nice. An improvement, but Finally got the sub tank crash. Try it again. This has been a good run. This is really nice. If I die to this skip, like, again, I'm going to be kind of upset. Well, if I die more than once specifically, I don't know. I, if, I, if I die to the thing just like instantly me under the log, because I tried to make it happen again and figure out what causes it, and I just, it just never happened again. So like, I don't know, it's impossible. Go, go, go! That was pretty quick. Yeah, I don't know why I thought everything was taking forever at the end of Crash. Like, I guess it was all normal. I, I got water record. Gold split. But it just felt like the helicopter is delayed. The, the letting me jump down there is delayed. Everything's bad. Just being way too impatient, I guess. Um, doing what I did just there it makes Gideon faster. By like a couple seconds. Just basically following him the whole way. There's a few spots he likes to stop for a second. If you're not right behind him, it's weird. And right when he runs past the last tree is when you can start going fast. Chopper's moving off. We're good to go. Sync your visor to my signature. Move slow near hostiles. Don't let them hear you. Drone. Watch your energy cells. Move it and drain them out. 
patrol approaching. We'll take the one in front. Slowly now. These are unsuppressed. Only fire as a last resort. Let's keep a lid on things. Keep it. This is Sentinel 2 1. A helo smoked in hard. We're in E and E mode, in need of immediate exfil. Negative Sentinel 2 1. Try to. God, what's that doing? It's like so not where it normally is. Is he gonna kill me? Don't do it. Okay, we good. Holy shit. And so yeah, I basically figured out last round that stealthing is pointless there. It just shoots you anyway if you're gonna die. Well, that was very nice. I want the other one. Gideon should be right here. Nice. What the hell? <laughs> Haven't seen that before. Good. We need an exfil sharpish. Had to drop a few of their guys. It's gonna be a riot when they discover the bodies. Mission isn't over yet. Get up. The mission was over before it began. We're not leaving until we take a look at this place. I don't see a fucking thing. Knox, show him. Let me get my feed. Him with the signature, boss. And lots of it. They've got something to hide. We lost the initiative. We should come back another day. There is no other day. This thing goes sideways. It's on you, Mr. It's always been on me. He's a hard bastard. I'll give him that. Let's get it done. Look at this. We're usually planning this charge at like six minutes. Massive time save. This is all breachable. 529 SMH. I've had a 528 before. Disco Ball Cormac, once again. Very nice. No, I'm blocking everything. <laughs> Now I just have to not go too fast through this next section, which is very nice because I'm just going to throw grenades and be safe. Bingo, we have the package transmitted. Uplink confirmed. All right, burn it down. Thermite out. Oh, Gideon, I don't think I've ever seen Gideon with it. I think it's, I've only seen Cormac with it. With the disco bot. <laughs> okay, that's funny. Package received. Good job. Proceed with second target. Two, three, be advised. We've got enemy packs swarming the target. They just activated a sensor net. Our cloak is going to be useless. Okay, stealth's no longer an option. Watch out for sentries. They'll scramble our exos. Go. That guy legit just spawned. What the heck? Take my 
time. We're here. I've got trace toxins on these canisters. This is all mana cool. Mitchell, where's the FRB? Let's seal this up. Everyone out! Nice up floor. We're good. I was a little bit terrified. I like I definitely didn't go that fast, but like I don't know. Primary LZ is too hot. Sky's full of hostiles. We have established LZ black three clicks to the southeast. We've ID'd a T740 in the south hangar. That's your ride. Understood. We're moving. I don't think Nox is going fast, sadly. Wait, that's... What the heck? Nox, don't throw? Is he based on where I am, maybe? Should I not run up here so early? Damn, that's unfortunate. It's only a small time loss, but... That part I still haven't like, figured out what, what Nox's deal is. I should probably uh, experiment with that some more. Absolutely right. And now we wait. Just gotta hope this doesn't crash, so I get the gold that I want. <laughs> that should with the 60 FPS stuff, but we'll see. This is alright. Knox, see if you can get it running. Copy that. T740, still only a prototype. Can't be that different from a 600. Powering it up. Mitchell and I trained up on the 600s. Most trusted of you. Disengage. The charge is fully on. Wings in. With the signal 2 3. In route to LZ Black. ETA 10 miles. Request to stop on the LZ with fire. Roger that, Sentinel 2 3. Bird is in an offset orbit. Standing by. All right. Everyone in. Systems check green. All right, Mitchell. Just like in training. Weapon systems no crash. Very nice. Move it out, Mitchell. They're on to it. Fire when ready. Use missiles against it. I feel like chat has gone oddly quiet. <laughs> I, I feel like this happens when I'm on good pace runs. Like you guys don't want to distract me or something. Approaching. The LZ just over that range. 
Look how fast this biolab is. This Act 2 is actually incredible. What, what even went wrong in this Act 2? I was slightly bad on some movement in Utopia, and I was slightly bad on some grapples in Sentinel. Like, barely, but they both still golded anyway. And I was slightly bad on manhunt skips, but like, barely. And Anox was slightly bad on biolab. This Act 2 was actually insane. It's like, basically perfect. Oh my god, the blinding. The blinding can skip all. I cannot see anything. That is Crash Water Record, yeah. It's Utopia Water Record, Crash Water Record, Biolab Water Record. I did have a 14 14 Biolab that I didn't record, and because of Nox trolling here, I didn't beat that, but like, it's still really good, so whatever. Not 14 19, I'm triggered. That was an improvement, <laughs> but it's not hard to improve on garbage. I am Try it again. To be the that was really good. No! I uncapped FPS for like a second and the game instantly crashed. Why? Why would you do that? Well, rip my splits. Like, the game just gets so crash-prone if you're avoiding crashes for too long. It's crazy. On the bright side, I probably don't need to worry about capping on um, on Armada like I where I crashed in last round, but like I'm probably gonna do it anyway. Crashless runs are actually so impossible. It's kind of funny. Do that, holy shit. <laughs> okay, we're good. Yeah, at least it was at the beginning. It was a good spot for a crash, really. I was just hoping to get zero crashes to get some like really nice splits, but oh well. Oh my god, okay, thank you. This is literally worse than driving in GTA. Probably true, Andy. That's definitely how uh, AW is, or at least like I, I've noticed the um, the longer I am into a run without having it crash, the more likely it is to crash in like really weird spots where it, where it definitely wouldn't normally. It's like it just gets unstable. That's annoying. It's not what I expected to run out of boost. That saves time. I'm gonna do it from now on, I guess. Sentinel zero one. The carrier is almost clear of the bridge. Yeah, that's nice. 
Yeah, I, I, that's probably what it is. It's probably that, but like, advanced warfare is just even worse. <laughs> like, you can't get through a whole run without it crashing, really. The only crash this run I've had so far was my veteran war record. Which is honestly, it's kind of nice to have a PB that was crashless. But it's the only one. And if this run continues going as it is, I'm probably done running recruit. Because the only real time losses were, um... I mean, fishing was kind of dumb. I lost like 40 seconds in two places. But if I do Act 3 good enough, then I'll be pretty happy. I might just do Act 1 runs or something or something. Do it at 45. Or maybe I'll completely throw the run and I'll have to do it all again. We'll see. That is a risky boost. He he almost overshot that. Like imagine going too far there. <laughs> Numbers on vet, no thanks. Okay, I lost like thirty seconds almost to that. Jesus. Alice is trying to take control of the carrier's weapon systems. We need to get jammers on those rail guns and fire technicians some time. We've got enemy troops all over the carrier. They're gonna try and take the ship's bridge. Let's move. We won't let them get away with this. Contact by the jack! The heck? Get to the rail gun and plant the jammer. Jammer is set. One more to go. Two warbirds coming from the west. What's my secondary weapon? Hmm. There's something target enhancer here. Nah, who cares? Oh, that's a shotgun. Screw that. We need to get to the so you have 162 on this. 160. So the MDL is the same speed as HPR A3. If Dylan is even still there. <laughs> Just like Utopia, there's so much trash everywhere. There's no way he's alive, what the heck? There we go. What's he shooting at? <laughs> Through the door. Those cargo ships are carrying up the fleet. We just lost another boat. We're almost at the bridge. Oh my god. I think we're good. I think that's everyone. Yeah, we're good. I'm gonna cap FPSA just in case. 
Okay, linking in. I need you to target for me, Mitchell. Get on that terminal. Target that cargo ship. Hold steady on the cargo ship, Mitchell. Cargo ship is down. Switching to the second ship. There's no turning back from this. What happens next? Next? Irons just murdered thousands of innocent people on U.S. soil. Next? We hunt them down. Couple seconds of cool, not bad. Sentinel 2 1, approaching APC Romeo Victor North at Angels 5. Roger that. Maintain low level flight from there to New Baghdad. Kingpin out. Sentinel flight, fence in. Engage anything that doesn't have a Sentinel beacon. Yeah, this <laughs> something. This is basically guaranteed new world record. If nothing goes terribly wrong, it's the run I'm happy with, <laughs> which went really quickly. Um, there would have to be so much going wrong to stop this new world record. It's more than two minutes ahead at the moment. Copy all zero one. Your squad is off the radar. Captured civilians can definitely happen. This level is also not great, um, so hopefully it'll just be, go smoothly, but like, killing the uh, the Sentinels, whatever they're called, is kind of sketch sometimes. The heck? that record, do it.
the AM1 doesn't seem that fast, maybe. The main thing that's fast about it is if I'm not bad. Okay, that was kind of dumb. The fact that I'm moving while killing it is kind of huge. Don't turn around, that's cringe. I literally got there too quickly, wow. <laughs> so you definitely want to grapple the last one because of that. That was cringe though, it just turned around, it just like would not get attacked. It's so, I don't know what, like, what controls that, it just seems to happen sometimes. Takes way longer. Yeah, the middle one went really well, the, the last one was terrible. Getting headshots helps, I think. The funny thing is, I mean, that's tracking aim, right? Which is by far the worst. <laughs> like anytime I do aim, uh, aim labs or any like aim testing programs, I'm just I'm trash at tracking compared to everything else. But they're not moving that much. It's barely tracking, honestly. I was definitely like a 10 15 seconds down the drain because that last one took forever. Each and every one of you can be agents of change. Yes, we will suffer losses, we will suffer setbacks, but make no mistake, we will win. The security that you desire, the security that you deserve, is within our grasp. But it can only be claimed if you are willing to fight. Fight. Yeah, like 15. That makes sense. I've cheated death many times. Got and boring time. <laughs> oh my god. 18 minutes of cringe. Stay alert. Any detail can make the difference. What is this place? It used to be a research lab. Looks like Iron's modified it since. Research for what? Medical advancements, something like that. Doesn't matter. So, Panda, what you're saying is. It's a prison now. Okay, damn, you weren't supposed to say that. <laughs> you're supposed to say if there's no captured, then you wouldn't be here. And then I was going to roast you with. Then it would just be a net positive in every way if we didn't have captured. But, damn. This is it. You had to go with speedrun mode. Where's the opportunity? Everyone off the truck now. What Panda's saying is, uh, he got, he like got interested in COD speedrunning because I uploaded a record on this level and he saw it. And then like, so shortly after that, he uh, basically joined the community, started watching streams and all that stuff. I swear I'm getting a headache watching this at 60 FPS. Not good. This is not promising for playing Black Ops 2 at 60 FPS all the way through. Is there a rescue force coming for us? Downtown is contaminated. We pulled out the city entirely. I don't think anybody's coming. Alright, let's go guys. Out of the pen. Out of the pen now. Move it. Here. Now. Get over here. Let's go. Start walking. So do you know where Atlas is? Like where is their main base? Cause not in America, right? But like I don't pay attention to any of this stuff obviously. What are you? Roger that. Cease 
city they had. Oh yeah, that's right. They mentioned that in Utopia, I think. But they basically like fixed the city massively and everyone loves them. That's so that's where their main base is. Is it a new place or is it the same city renamed? I assumed it was like the same city, but I could just be wrong. Stop looking! We got incoming to see six Sucks to be these guys. That's far enough. Uh, get him on the floor. <clears throat> Open the shoe. That kind of makes sense, yeah. Open. Wires out. Clear. Hook him up. Go. Put that down. Have a nice day. I wanted to meet the man whose mission it was to kill me. Our mission is to stop you. <clears throat> if that meant killing you, I don't think anybody'd be too troubled. Failure is not riveting gameplay, exactly. Atlas, so I'm disturbed that three of my best contractors have failed so miserably. I mean, you technically had control in a couple spots, it has to be. but like from the chat, eight and a half minutes until you do anything noteworthy, <laughs> basically. The ancient Spartans knew the true meaning of warfare. But that truth has been lost to us for two millennia. What of your son, Will? What was he? Wheat or chaff? Will was the victim of the misguided policies of the United States government. Will died fighting for what he believed in. Of course, the tragedy is dying for what you believe in doesn't make it true. Yeah, I'm pretty sure Sledgehammer is like 100% of the opinion that people play code campaigns once and never again. I mean, and obviously speedrunners are the people that play things over and over again. But even casuals, if they enjoy a game, will play it more than once. And it's it's hard to do that when there's so much movie crammed into it. If you have good gameplay, people will come back for it. I don't even have control of my camera either, like at all. It's like it's so bad. I played MW two six times, in, uh, like back in the day. I wasn't into speedrunning at that point when it first came out. A second chance. Very <laughs> victory still sold in this level. It's close. I had a list of the longest level somewhere. I think it was third. I think there was something else that was longer than it. I don't know the Black Ops 3 levels at length yeah. though, but they're pretty long too. What this mission should be is a full cutscene level like Coop that we can skip, and then the actual level where you fight people. Or it should literally just start right here. <laughs> Honestly, like the first six minutes is completely pointless. Like put that in put that in the load intro or something. The loading cinematic. Starting here kinda makes sense. The first one? What about Hyper Center? I thought that was pretty long. Or does it just have like a ton of skips? The longest mission is the World War II mission, which is like 30% tank level. <laughs> but like it's still a lot of tank level. Yeah, okay. So what, how long are both those levels? Or how long is Black Ops? Right, follow me. Stay quiet. Eighteen. Okay, yeah. The crazy thing is, when you play casually, like those levels are so long. Was it nine levels? And it tends to take people like four hours for the first casual completion. Insane. Yeah, NDT. Hold on, I'm coming. 
He's around in the server in places, just like ping him about whatever skip you're talking about. If it exists, he'll find a use for it probably. He just he has like all of the Black Ops 3 knowledge downloaded into his brain. You look like his size. Grab his exosuit and side arm. Run co op Black Ops 3. Yeah. Yeah. With only one wing, you won't be reloading. So make every shot count. I'm very curious how you do in Black Ops 3 compared to AW, because so few people have crossed over into Black Ops 3 like seriously and properly that it's really hard to compare how good times are or how optimized like things access. are. It's really, really just like way. one guy and his friends just grinding that game. It crashed again. God damn it. I've never seen it crash there before. How far back am I? I've cheated death many times. Got right up. Okay, that didn't even send me very far back. That's fine. Like surface access. Ilona, this way. Mitchell, get on that console and get the door open. Hurry up. Give me that. What happened? Doors locked. Stand back. That could be why I didn't like S1X. Well, though, I think Mitchell, it was something else. I feel like there was something specific that it was doing that I didn't like. I can't remember. Of course, he's still alive. Okay, if I remember right, I have this next section. So I've got three enemies here, and then it's the civilians after this, right? So I'm going to take this, because they tend to be more likely to drop the gun you don't have. Because I don't want this against the civilians. Okay, Okay, no, they just dropped. Oh, here it is. Yeah, that's civilians here. The AMR 9 is decent. It can one burst the red enemies if you get all headshots. Um, it definitely seems better against them than the SMG is. But yeah, like. The fact that it's a five round burst is so like clunky. It's especially bad around the civilians. So this is Iron's vision for the future. He's insane. I'll be damned if we let him get away with this. Okay. No choke time. Out of the way! Move! Uh, the guns are usually randomized, yeah. Oh my god, what the hell is that guy doing? That was so cringe, I actually almost died there. I almost failed, I mean. Very good. God damn. Damn, that's low on ammo. Gotta keep moving. On the fucking ground. Take it easy. Let's ah, down. Ah, down. Oh, oh my god. You don't you fucking move. Get back or I'll shoot. Come on, get the door. There was some serious confidence there that the guy had no idea how to aim a pistol. <laughs> Somehow it worked. Let's go. 
So I've crashed twice so far in this run. I think each crash lost about 20 seconds. So we'll see. It's likely going to be a 223, like, after the crashes are removed. You can sort of get on high ledges in the room, but it hasn't lit anywhere. Damn. I feel like you're going to find a big skip right after I'm done with this run, and then we have to do it again. <laughs> Which will still be cool, I'd still do it, but like, damn. There's definitely more skips, yeah. The game, the game is just so like, receptive to them, if that makes sense. Like, if you can get out of bounds in this game, it feels like you can just make it a skip. Whereas in most games, you can get out of bounds, but then you can't do anything with it, because it's just like, no, you need all these other prerequisites to do the next thing. It just doesn't work. His gun just got sent into the abyss. Yeah, it's gonna be another pistol, why not? Can I have a gun? What the heck? That was insane. There he is. That was actually crazy though. <laughs> they were just lined up. <laughs> I've never had that happen before. You just saw it went out of bounds skips. Black Ops 3 is probably not the game for you. I think Entity's like routed that game to death almost. But um Ready. I was not ready. Oh, you actually have to mantle it, I think. What the heck? Weird. Anyway. Like I jumped and it was just solid. Couldn't find a gun. Yeah. You can just melee the guys if you run out of ammo though. And it will take that gun when they die. And the melee without a gun is a lot more powerful than the melee with a gun, for whatever reason. Because you have a knife, I guess. Okay, here's a question. Who is the worst teammate in any COD game? It's basically every two COD 2 teammate, but I don't know their names, so they don't count. Everyone likes to meme on Pauly, but with current strats, he's not too bad in MW2. I think Soap is actually the worst teammate in MW2 right now. Although, no, it's Pauly on Whiskey Hotel. Pauly's trash. Hello, F? That took forever. Ready. 
Keith in COD 3. I'm just going to shoot these really bad because I know nothing about COD 3. <laughs> it's actually Gideon. <laughs> yeah. This, considering I crashed, this is crazy fast. What the heck? What am I doing? I'm, like, I'm not doing capture differently. I just keep hitting, like, really fast times. Let's pray we're not too late. It crashed. God damn it. I was at 60 FPS and everything. <laughs> so I don't... I feel like 60 FPS helps, but, like, not really. It's still crashing so much. Alright then. Got to time out like three crashes now, Jesus Christ. The actual answer is game bad, yes. It was a plan only Gideon could have come up with. A frontal assault on iron. I guess I'm gonna do this whole section at 60 FPS. Actually I'm not gonna bother, it shouldn't crash, yeah. And if it does, I mean I've just got I've got a time out crashes anyway. Yeah, it was after the level ended. It always is. It's just so weird that one. <laughs> Everything ready. People get so annoyed by those voices, those predator voices. I just don't care. I don't know. I'm immune. I think, I think, like, playing Portal 2 as much as I did with GLaDOS's dialogue playing every time you play the level really helps me just, like, completely ignore all of that. I never ever hit this gun, it's crazy. Now we get to hear main gun ready. <laughs> Okay, I have to hold F here. Yeah, everyone's dead. Can I hold F early though? I, I'm not going. I'm not going. I'm going to wait for it to tell me to. Just in case. Yeah. Can almost always. Do, yeah, almost being the keyboard there, and I never trust it. <laughs> There's a few where you can't. And it's like, it's so inconsistent across every single COD game, and inside certain COD games as well, whether you hold, or whether you spam, or whether you can do it early or not, and it's like, ugh, so painful. You can't think of one where you can't? Okay, maybe I'm just wrong, so just run straight to that rock, good job me. Wall runs. Faster. It's like strafing, but in a straight line. It's exactly, you know the jump I showed you on Manhunt, the new Out of Bounds? That's a wall run too. That's why I can just jump it. Ready. 
How many of them are there? What the heck? <laughs> okay, I'm pretty sure that's everyone. I didn't go the wrong way again. It just takes time for this. Also, I don't know what you mean again. That was insane. That was the best I've ever cleared that. Yesterday I popped out in the same area. Oh, I didn't know there was another route to take. Is the other route faster? Because I'm not 100% sure what exactly triggers that door to open, but I thought it was when you exit the water, so maybe the other route makes that door move faster, maybe it doesn't. That was moving there. That was actually like crazy how cleanly I did that. Get all the names I should take a look. Doc links that recently. I'm also going to do this earlier just to be safe because I hate this thing. <laughs> and people are going to tell me to do it later because it saves like 0.3 seconds. But no. Thank you. I also will run here, by the way. I'm pretty sure it's faster. But it's kind of weird. It slows you down a lot of the time. It's like, I don't know, it's really strange. But yeah, you can get up to 110 velocity on the wall here. Which is obviously way faster than you can just walk in the Some walls definitely suck. Um, it's an FPS thing sometimes as well. Like, I couldn't do the manhunt out of bounds where you like walk around the thin ledge at the top. Um, until I catch my FPS to 150 or 144, because it was just like really sticky and weird. But then there's also the walls at the start of Manhunt, uh, when you're walking around to melee the guy from behind. Yeah, you just like can't walk around them, it's weird. 111, yes. Yeah, it's pretty cool, Andy. Like, both today, we just took off, like, much time. I just have to not trick this sec. This is the last place you can trick, really. I missed. Correct. How am I missing this guy this much? Okay. What? Okay. That guy was throwing. That wasn't even my fault. He just took forever to run around the corner. That was pretty bad, I'm not gonna lie, but it doesn't matter. This is still the 223 after all the loads are removed. I unlock the loads, the uh, crashes. Yeah, I I can turn a dot on on my monitor, but like, I don't know. <laughs> it's probably worth it for that thing. 
I'll probably just demolish that with the door on the center of my screen. But I'm I'm very bad at doing these centers with that cheats. This building any minute. It's it's a thing you can't um, you can't moderate that properly. I would be on the side of no I'm dots allowed if you could enforce it, but you you can't. Like people just put a dot on the screen, and it's that simple. And you can't know if they did it or not. And yeah, that too. It, it kind of makes up for controller's aim assist cheats. Hello, Mitchell. Don't you fucking move. I could ask the same of you. He's hacking into our exos. Can you plug in a controller on PC and like get full con full console stuff like things. aim assist and everything? The city is falling. It's over. What I have started won't end with me. It's bigger than me, and it's certainly bigger than you. You think I'm a monster? Yeah. Okay. That's only because you. I wasn't. Sure. I thought you played on console like back necessary. in the day. I knew you played on PC necessary. now. The attack on America. But like I'm a year and a half ago, I thought you were on console. Killing thousands of innocent people. I'm saving the world from itself. When there's no one left to challenge Atlas, there will be no more wars. There had to be sacrifices along the way. Yeah. Twisted fucks throughout history have used the same argument. I don't know who stopped the launch. They'll bring this entire building down on top of yeah, you. Yeah, yeah, that's what I, I killed you in the prison camp. I could kill you Is now. Is there no rifling on that pistol barrel? But I won't. I'm not a monster. <laughs> AW is good if you're good at the skips. Try to hit the release on your exo. Now mine. It's not working. There's no time. If he gets away, this will all have been for nothing. Go. No! Don't let Irons get away! Hurry, Mitch! Keep going! They won't be IL or whatever, I think. Although, maybe I did do one part pretty quickly. There's only two choices. You either pull me up, or this whole building goes down and we go down with it. Mitchell! What are you doing? What are you doing? Mitchell! I gave you that arm. Mitchell, I gave you a second chance. There's so much F spamming in these last few levels. That was IR record for Terminus. Damn, by a lot too. What a clutch. That was a 223 with crashes. Insane. <laughs> so that's um That's almost a 222, I think. I'll have to we'll, just, we'll see when it's retimed. That's crazy. I was not expecting a low 223. I'm so happy with that. I've got you, the only real time I've losses got were... Um, just like scroll through real quick. Uh, induction was slightly bad. I was like 10 to 15 seconds. Atlas was kind of bad, but like, I don't know. <laughs> Vision lost 40 seconds because I'm trash. Aftermath lost... Compared to gold, Aftermath lost 40. So like, I'm probably being a bit harsh there because Atlas also lost 40 compared to gold, I think. So that's really unreasonable to get that close. Was right about what and every act two was incredible. Like it was perfect. So was it, yeah. <laughs> uh, and everything else was really good. Was so I think I lost like ten seconds on throttle. That was a little bit sketch. I basically lost two minutes over golds. Like that was really good. My goal was high two twenty four. Like that was my maximum goal. But after the new finds, I wanted the two twenty three. So easy goal, done. The COD4 guy is live again.